Check my clock, I can't stop. Fuck around, make my 40 pop. No pop con, I pop pistols. What it do YouTube, my name is Bear Witness, welcome back to the channel, and in today's video we're going to be talking about the Anthem beta and everything that you guys need to know, or should know, uh, regarding the beta coming up this Friday, or this weekend, for some players. But before we get into all that guys, I want to say if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys check my description, because I have a link to my $25 giveaway, and with this, it's kind of like us giving back for you guys coming to the channel, you know, supporting me. So that being said, there is a, lot, a ton of cards that you guys can pick from, there's a list down below, you know, we're giving away two, so there's two potential winners, so tell your friends and things like that. You guys can get iTunes cards, Xbox cards, PlayStation cards, Best Buy cards. You know, pretty much anything that you guys can potentially want. It's on that list, you know. And, you know, you guys receive that at the end of the giveaway, which is, I think, next Tuesday. So make sure you guys get signed up for that. With all of that being said, guys, welcome to the channel. Now, we're going to be talking about the beta today and exactly what you guys can expect. Now, the beta comes out this Friday for people that pre-ordered the game and or are part of the Origins Access Premiere Program is what I think it's called. Anyways, it's a PC program over there on at Origins uh, or the Origins like store, Steam thing, whatever, whatever you want to call it. Um, but... You know, you guys get access to it this Friday. You guys have three days to play it and kind of experience the game, as well as people that did not pre-order it get access to it on February 1st through the 3rd. Um, so you guys are able to experience that, and you guys can maybe potentially set up your pre-orders before the game launches next month. Now, the game officially releases at February 22nd. That's something that a lot of people ask me, especially when, like, they're talking to me about the game, and I'm talking to them about the game. They're like, when's it come out? It officially releases February 22nd, which is also my birthday, so that's what's up. Um, aside from that, you know, there these are a couple of things that you guys can expect when, you, when launching the game and we're playing the game. The first thing you're going to do is you're going to experience the game in, um, with... On uh, the the balancing, the weapon balancing is going to be a little bit different. Your abilities, your damage abilities, all of that type of stuff. That probably the damage you take as well. It's all going to be a little bit tweaked, just for the fact that they're throwing you into the game in the middle of it, and they don't want you to be overwhelmed with things. So they've scaled things up to make it, uh, you know, a little bit more fun. You know, you guys get to experience a couple more things, but it's definitely not something you guys should expect in the actual game. In fact, a lot of betas do this, so it's not any surprise. But I'm really glad they took a time to actually tell us that, so we didn't expect something and then get feel like it's severely nerfed i really feel like ea has gone through enough of like not necessarily telling everything so the fact that they're trying to tell us that now is actually pretty cool also there is microtransactions in this game i don't know if they'll be accessible in the beta uh and i also don't know if your beta progress will carry over i probably not like i said uh, nine times out of ten i can guarantee you that it probably won't based on the fact that like i said they're putting you in the middle of the game and they probably don't want to let you do anything like that now it is a potential possibility that maybe your colors stay the same also when you do play the beta at part of the vip program you get a special in-game item i actually am not 100 percent sure what that is yet but there you go on that um but you are you are going to be able to potentially you know get microtransaction these are strictly cosmetic and these are the things that you know sometimes they freak people out uh there is i i don't know if it's a loot box type system when i i bring up the 143 questions situation a lot uh, based on the uh like the video i was telling you guys about the 143 questions that they rapid fire uh, asked to the one of the developers over at anthem now at the time he did say that there will be no um loot boxes but i don't know necessarily there might be like i said just random things you can buy for your your armor itself uh probably just colors and things like that um uh, we know now that there's post-launch dlc and i know that we're talking about the beta but i'm kind of just fleshing everything out there there is post-launch dlc which like i said obviously you're not going to be able to access right now but that is completely free so that was just a up like that was that's the thing that i thought was very positive to go ahead and talk about because if you guys are new to the channel you guys probably haven't seen yet that i had a video the other day talking about how i wondered what the dlc was going to look like considering it's a mostly pve game now they did say that there will be no pve at, i mean pvp at launch now they specifically said that there will not be pvp at launch which was a lot better than their stance like i said referring to that video one more time of you know they said there is no pvp and i made a you know i made a i, I spoke about that i spoke the fact that there might be PvP, pvp later on it wouldn't be something that we haven't seen before and they haven't said in fact said that we for the moment we will not be having pvp at launch now there was a couple of other things that i'm going to bring up i have to open up my computer screen so i can actually tell you guys these things um you can't uh, Anthem can be played single player or, or in a team of four, but always requires an internet connection. Anthem has a branching story, but not to the degree you might expect from other Bioware games. Um, kind of like in the idea of Mass Effect and the idea of 
um, Dragon Age. So, you can't romance non-player characters unlike in Mass Effect and Dragon Age. Uh, so, there is no romance or anything like that. Uh, you know, we talked about the post-launch DLC. We talked about the PvP at launch. And every group activity, which is, this is another thing that I wanted to talk to you guys about. Every group activity has built-in matchmaking, so you never have to play this game alone. You can if you want to. You can obviously turn it off, but you never have to play alone. And that's another thing that's really cool because sometimes you kind of get stuck in these situations where you're playing alone and it's not very fun. So hopefully all of this stuff is a little bit more enticing to you guys when it comes to the beta. Um, I hope that a lot of people are hopping on the beta with me this weekend and have a lot of fun playing the beta this weekend because I will be on it if you guys want to you guys can leave your PSNs because I will be playing in um, on X on PlayStation if you guys want to you can leave your PSNs down below and I'll be glad to jump on with you guys as well as I will go ahead and be playing the free weekend for everybody as well the open weekend as well because I am super hyped for this game I'm super excited I feel like it's almost destiny for me to be playing it uh, you know uh, obvious pun there but i didn't mean for that that was unintentional but um because it's coming out on my birthday so you know once again i'm really excited about this game hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and it gave you guys kind of an insight of what's coming to the world of anthem <laughs> and uh if you guys did enjoy this video you guys know what to do leave a like down below as well as clicking that sub button and that bell to be notified on every single one of my videos and thank you guys for coming to the video today with that being said i'm out of here peace